Kiyoki, and I'm a preservation librarian at the University of Hawaii Libraries. Yes, I moved to Hawaii from uh, this January. Yeah. <laughs> Um, before I start, I want to ask you, how many of you involving involved in digital 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 project? Many of them? Okay. Uh, how many of you, may, um, maybe when you uh, design and develop digital project, maybe you focus on uh, how many images were created or how, what kind of cool things you can do with them? But how many of you uh, thought of, think about these digital resources will exist for 50 years or even next 10 years? Or what is going on or going to happen when or during or after you are digitizing these uh, materials? So I was wondering when I was uh, listening to Professor Watanabe's uh, presentation, you know, after his retirement, what's going to happen to his cool materials? You know? <laughs> or what's going to happen you at the Shinpo, the newspaper, if the newspaper company is bankrupt? So this session, this session is intended to um, uh, propose or give you the kind of preservation perspective and other complicated issues involved in digital scholarship. So first two presenters, Setsuko Noguchi and Haruko Nakamura will share their experiences and thoughts as digital project managers and the corrections custodian by using examples of digitizing rare Japanese materials purchased through NCC's multi-volume set, grant, and other resources. Then, third presenter, Steve Marks, will talk principles and ideas that box the practices to help you to navigate the digital preservation issues. Just a brief introduction to the three uh, presenter. Uh, Setsuko Noguchi is a Japanese studies librarian at Princeton University and the current chair of NECC. She will discuss the conservation, digitization, and the use of a set of rare Japanese documents from the 1620s. Haruko Nakamura is the librarian of the Japanese collection at Yale University. Haruko recently collaborated with colleagues at the Beinecke Library and Yale Art Museum in the conservation and, the, and digitization of 18th, 18, 1827 manuscript and 1883 woodblocks. And she will discuss digitization project of these materials. Steve Marx is a digital preservation librarian at the University of Toronto, where he is responsible for planning policy and workflows to ensure the longevity of the university's digital asset. So first, Sesko-san, please. 